huh? Okay. What to do? Can't go wrong with apple juice. Me and Nachan used to drink it all the time when we were kids. There you are. I've been looking for you. <sighs> Don't you have anything better to do? Takamiya-san, you are the Holmes. And I am the Watson, Erika Aiba, at your service. Please, call me Erika. I will do my best to assist you in solving mysteries. How would you like to start? So, what should we do? Conduct interviews? <laughs> I love mystery novels. I've always wanted to be a detective, too. I met Aiba while I was trying to find out more about Nachan. Seems she likes me. Follows me around like a damn puppy dog. Even my steeliest glare doesn't phase her. Frickin' weirdo. Nachan, my childhood friend. We went our separate ways in middle school. But we still kept writing to each other. She's the only person I really care about. Shikishima. It's that company with all those commercials for TVs and fridges. So they're making weapons, too? Special Investigations Unit. That damn Four Eyes. He says there's some spy agency. It's short for Special Investigations Unit. They may not be cops, but they're honestly all the same to me. Are you upset with me? Just been antsy without my cigarettes. I'm not playing pretend, you know. Uh, yes, of course. I am merely your capable assistant. Huh? Well, at least I'll try to be. What should we look into first? It's been several days since Minami-san has gone missing. She isn't sick, contrary to what her teacher says. And she didn't run away, contrary to the rumor that's been going around. It seems likely she was involved in something much more sinister. The wind feels nice. Been keeping this place all to yourself, huh? This place is a dump. Someone's drying their handkerchief. Wonder which girl this belongs to. This is Amiguchi's. He got a 92? <laughs> Maybe he's not just a dumb pretty boy after all. Then again, he did ball this up and leave it on the ground. Yep, still an idiot. Some flirty rich kid who won't stop following me around. He seems to be close friends with a gang leader at Sakura. to it, doesn't it? Maybe Nachan's in here. Or not. Have a minute. 
I got some things to ask you. What? Huh? She was... She's a name on the list in Four Eyes' file. Her name... It was Yakushiji. She's pretty dull, actually. Natsuno Minami's still out, huh? Seems like it. Did you notice anything strange about her? Before she started taking days off, I mean? Well, I haven't really thought about it. But now that you mention it... I noticed she was always hurrying to the track room at break. Even during class. She seemed to always be a bit anxious. The track room, huh? Was there something else? Was there something else? She was in the track room even during break. What was Nachan doing? Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. So, uh... Yes? Oh, could you be... I mean, the way you're dressed. Are you one of those Sukeban girls? <sighs> oh, are you, like, hiding a razor in your skirt right now? Uh, of course not. This is the first time I've seen one in real life? Oh, wow. Uh, is your friend okay? Can I help you? No. This girl. She's a name on the list in Four Eyes' file. Yuri Fuyusaka. The one next to her in the red glasses. Her, too. Tomi Kisaragi, I think. Now, you. You've been going to Natsuno Minami's house, yeah? Any news since? Oh. Nachan, my childhood friend. We went our separate, but we still... Is there anything else you noticed? About Natsuno Minami? Huh. I did see her fervently scribbling something in her notebook. And it didn't seem like it was just notes on the lecture. Mm -hmm. Nachan was writing things in this notebook. Things that had nothing to do with her classes. Could it have something to do with her disappearance? Did you see that cute handkerchief? The one tied to the fence on the roof? I wonder whose it is. You think it's some sort of sign to her lover? Oh. Stay here. I can see it clearly now. The primary suspect. I am certain. Their intentions were not pure.
You're on the track team, right? I'm a second year and captain of the track team. Did you need something? I wanted to ask you about Natsunomi Nami. She skipped out on our last few training sessions. But I guess she's out sick? Did she look sick to you? She looked fine to me. Right? <sighs> yep. I thought so too. Hello! I think it was after that one incident. That's when Minami-san started skipping training. And school too, I guess. What incident? There was a fire in the North Building. Oh, yeah! Maybe it's unrelated. But... Right around the time of that fire, Nachan started skipping her training sessions for track. Could it be related? A fire? In the North Building? Yeah. I heard an explosion started it. Really? I heard it was arson. Right around the time of that... Nachan, my... You on the track team? Yes. Natsunomi Nami is too, right? Did you notice anything strange about her? Besides her being absent from school. Well, depends what you define as strange, but... Natsuno did stop coming to training. But I'd still see her in the locker room. Doing what? It seemed like she was there to get something. Something like... Some kind of UFO-looking thing? I don't know exactly. It just looked like a box when it was in her bag. A box in the locker room, huh? Yeah. Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. She said Nachon went into the locker room to get a box. And described it as some kind of UFO gadget. Hmm. you know anything about the fire in the North Building? No. You heard anything about that fire in the North Building? No, I'm sorry. I don't know anything. personnel only it's just a damn locker room can't get in the locker room as long as that ditz is around guess I have no choice I gotta ask for her help yo Iba I want to take a look around the track room. But that goody two-shoes over there keeps stopping me. Uh, you want me to be a decoy? What, you don't want to do it? Oh, good heavens! You and I are partners, Takamiya-san. I shall not let you down. Yeah, okay. Just hold her attention until I get inside the room. Wait for me out here when you're done. I beg your pardon. Oh, yeah? I would like to inquire about Minami-san. You too? Oh, was there someone else? Well, yeah. 
what did you want to know about Natsuno? Oh... Uh... Well... Uh... Oh... Uh... Well... Not chance. Found it. This must be that notebook. The one that girl in Not Chan's class was talking about. She said she saw her fervently scribbling into it. Hmm. Tiny nameplates. Not chance. Found it. Nothing I haven't already looked at. Huh? I thought you were supposed to be distracting that girl. She was called over by her senpai. So, off she went. Ugh. I thought I told you to wait outside. I can't do that. The locker room of the athletics building. Just think of the drama that unfolds here. What follows is an investigative record of important moments in time and space. I have finally encountered my destiny. He has arrived from outer space. An actual extraterrestrial being! In summary, whoa, aliens really do exist. An extraterrestrial being? Did Nachon make all this up? Or is it possible she really was abducted by aliens? What follows is an investigative record of important moments. These advanced life forms have managed to conquer time and space itself. Who could have dreamed that their technology had such capability? An actual gateway to time travel, right in Tokisaka Shrine! Tokisaka Shrine. Maybe Nachan went there. Either way, it's definitely a clue. What follows is an investigative... He says he's looking for a robot. It's called Sentinel Number 17. Writing inside of it seems to enable him to fight against evil aliens. A robot? Could this be what Four Eyes was talking about? Is this the weapon Shikishima is developing? What follow- These advanced- Yo, where's Tokisaka Shrine? It's nearby, actually. I should go check it out. Take me there, will ya? I'm gonna go grab my bag. I'll meet you at the front gate. Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. She said Nachon went into the locker room to get a box. And described it as some kind of UFO gadget. Hmm. Shinonome. Hey. Yuki Takamiya. Weren't you told not to contact me? <sighs> Wait. There was something you said before. I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. You said you hid something for me. Oh, right. 
You told me to hide it. You don't remember, do you? It was in the passageway to the old school building. The old school building? What happened there? You were watching something. It was being shown through a projector. And you started crying. A projector? Yeah, and you were saying something about Four Eyes. Mr. Ida? Ugh. So sudden. My pills. <sighs> Shino no me. Sorry to make you wait, Takamiya-san. Shall we get going? Give me a minute. It seems Shinonome has forgotten what happened in the old building's passageway. But I remember. Huh? It wasn't too long after I transferred here. I saw her. She was near the old school building. Hmm? I was thinking there were fewer people around here. So, this is the old school building. I heard it's gonna be demolished soon. No doubt it is old. It was built during the war. Seems like a shame, really. This place is so quiet. Would have been a perfect place to hang out. If I had been serious about my studies, I wonder if I could have got into Sakura the normal way. <laughs> yeah, right. Huh? My ID is now registered. I'm shutting off your AI function. Search for it. It's somewhere in your memory. Look for the information on me and Mr. Ida. It was all a lie. Is this me? From the future? His love was nothing but empty words. Mr. Ida. He was using me right from the very start. I was such a fool. We are all that remains of humanity. And still we deceive each other. So filled with hate. I have had enough. This can't be real. Humanity has always been fated for ruin. Project Ark was a mistake. But it is already in its second stage. I cannot stop it. All I can do is derail it. I have linked in parts of the terraforming project. The heavy machinery will then purge humans from all sectors. If everything goes according to plan, the final phase will be reset. And all sectors will fall into a never-ending loop. What remains will be a peaceful world. Finally free of humanity. No, I couldn't have. This place will be destroyed as well. The human race has reached its end. We have no need for a future. What in the hell? Wait a minute. You're the girl that was with four eyes. Shinonome, right? It's impossible. 
Are you okay? Did I do it? Was it really me? I destroyed the world? No, I won't believe it. Mr. Ida would never deceive me. What are you talking about? There's no way. That isn't my future. <laughs> Just take a deep breath, okay? Come on, stand up. Who were you talking about? Was it Four Eyes? If that's the future we're heading for, then what good are these? Shit. Medicine? Uh. Here. Uh. Don't you need these? Uh. Why? Why are you trying to help me? Well, I just... You're my senpai at the SIU, so... Uh. Oh, yeah. That thing is crazy. Is it a new kind of projector or something? this thing. I want to see that video again. Uh, hey, are you all right? Get that thing out of here. Please. Don't tell Mr. Ida. Don't tell anyone. Please. you collapsed on me like that. Uh, hey, whoa. You sure you're okay to get up? You all right? Uh. Here. It's your medicine. Morimura made you take those pills, too. It was the first thing she did when I carried you in here. Are you sure it's okay? To take so much of it, I mean. I don't understand. Why did you have my medicine? You threw the bottle on the ground, so I picked it up for you. I threw it? Yeah. Anyway, about that... thing. Are you sure it was okay? Huh? What? The thing you told me to hide. I said no such thing. Are you trying to play games with me? You were babbling on and on about that damn four eyes. And crying. A lot. What? Me? Don't lie to me. What the hell is going on with this girl? It literally just happened. Ugh. Shit, seriously? What are those for, anyways? I can't think straight unless I take them. I uh, know, dude. It looks like bad news to me. How are you feeling? 
I'm fine. Takamiya-san, please, just stay out of this. <sighs> Is something wrong? No. It's just... You don't look too well. Maybe some medicine would make you feel better. <laughs> I'm out of here. All right. Shinonome's condition is a bit worrying, but Nachan is my priority. Maybe if I ask around, I can retrace her steps. There you are. I've been looking for you. without my cigarettes. Can't go wrong with apple juice. Me and Nachan used to drink it all the time when we were kids. Ryoko Shinonome. Seems like she's completely forgotten. But she's the one who told me to hide that box in the first place. Guess I'll grab my bag. Oh, I'll go with you. Sorry to make you wait, Takamiya-san. Shall we get going? What follows is an... These advanced... Tokisaka Shrine. Maybe Nachan went either way. I searched every inch of this damn place. And I still got nothing. Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. She said Nachan went into... It's gotten quite dark. Why don't we call it a day? Yeah, all right. <sighs> Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Huh? 
Shinonome's condition is a bit worrying, but Nachan is my priority. Maybe if I ask around, I can retrace her steps. Can't go wrong with Apple Pea and Nachan used to drink. There you are. I've been looking for you. <sighs> this place is a dump. Are you upset with me? The wind feels nice. Been Someone's drawing their handkerchief. Yourself, huh? Wonder which girl this belongs to. Maybe Nachan's in here. Or not. Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. That fire in the North Building. Know anything about that? I heard a teacher talking about it. They said it was caused by a delinquent smoking cigarettes. It wasn't you, was it? Hey, I laid off the cigs after I transferred here. Which means I'm not getting my nicotine fix. Which means you better watch yourself. A delinquent smoking cigarettes. Well, there's only one of those lame asses here. Nenji Ogata. Built up a reputation as a tough guy. All the way back in middle school, actually. Every delinquent around here knows who he is. Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. There was a fire in the North Building, that right? That's what I've heard. I heard about that too. I'm glad it wasn't on this side of the school. Know anything else about it? Not me. Hmm. What follows is an... I have finally... You stay here. Don't talk to me. I'm Takamiya, with the SIU. I assume you've heard about me? So you're the student on the inside. So you're not here to supervise me? What's the deal, then? We received new intel. Confidential information from Shikishima was brought here. 
About those weapons? Cram it, will you? Just ignore me. Worry about your own mission. Hey. Don't talk to me. I thought I told you to wait out. I think it may be ill-advised to associate with hoodlums. Oh, Gata. Why are you here? It's a public roof, ain't it? I said, why are you here? Just checking if my handkerchief was dry yet. That handkerchief was yours? Yeah. So what? <laughs> I thought it was a girl's. <laughs> Are you trying to pick a fight with me? Oh, not me. Never. there was a fire in the north building i also heard that it was caused by a certain cigarette smoking delinquent you trying to accuse me of something first of all i don't smoke second of all the fire was in the girls bathroom and rumor has it it wasn't even really a fire happened in the girls bathroom of the north building something happened in the so about not i mean minami what are you getting embarrassed for you've called her that since you were kids right all right so nachan you know she's gone missing yeah, I do know. I suspect the black suits have something to do with that. Why do you say that? I saw Minami being chased by them one time. You what? What the hell is going on? Tim Four Eyes never mentioned that little detail. I also heard rumors about some kid in middle school. I guess he's been looking for her too. Something fishy's going on, but it's getting complicated. I can't keep up. <clears throat> the agent on Nachan's case, Shino Nome. Do I have to ask her for help after all? 
I mean, she is pretty messed up too. <sighs> Have I answered enough of your questions yet? Get lost. So this is Ogata's handkerchief. I want to take a look for myself. Let's go to that girl's bathroom in the North Building. Certainly. Holy shit. Are you seeing this? There's no way all this was from a fire. We are not allowed to be in here. Oh, we'll get in so much trouble if they find us. What is wrong with you? It just feels like we're actual detectives now. Judging from this level of destruction, I deduce that the perpetrator was someone with an extreme hatred for girls' bathrooms. Uh... Not one burn mark in sight. Seems more like a bear went on a rampage. These scratch marks, they're carved pretty deep in there. There's signs of damage all over the place. This can't have been the work of just one person. Someone's eyeglass frames. They're red, probably belong to a girl. constructed a criminal profile. Hmm. Our suspect is... a maintenance lady built like a bear. What do you think? Hmm. This isn't how I expected a crime scene to look. In mystery novels, the perpetrator's name is always written somewhere in blood. Yeah, when there's a dead body nearby. You really are strange. Any ideas? Who do you think these glasses belong to? Well, the glasses are broken, so they won't be wearing them anymore. Do you remember anyone wearing a pair like that? Now that I think about it... Yeah, I do remember someone. Nachan's friend in Class 1B. And a name on Four Eyes' list. Tomi Kisaragi. Tomi Kisaragi. I think I saw her in the Class 1 hallway just now. I gotta find her. Maybe whoever those glasses belong to knows something. Oh! Wait for me! Please don't run off like that so suddenly. I can't keep up. She was somewhere around here before. Where could she have gone? She's gotta be nearby.
Not here either. What's wrong? Oh, it's just that I think... I think I forgot something. I'm gonna go get it now. Glasses. What's this all about? Go ahead. Take a closer look. Well, they do look the same as mine. But you probably noticed. I'm wearing mine right now. So obviously they can't be mine. Hmm. You went to the girls' bathroom in the North Building, that right? What happened there? Oh, what's with all the questions anyways? I know you were there. Are you talking about what happened in the North Building? I had nothing to do with it. Why would I go all the way there to use the bathroom anyways? <sighs> all right, listen up. These glasses were found on the floor of the bathroom. And you're the only one in this whole damn school that wears glasses as distinctive as these. So you're blaming me? What could I possibly gain from setting a toilet on fire? Fire? You're not messing with me, are you? Actually... Yeah? I saw her... the day of the incident. Usami-chan was in the North Building. Miwako, what the hell? Uh, but I really did see you there. I saw Natsuno-chan there too. Wait, what? Uh, I feel bad for making them wait for me. I should hurry up and get these to the art room. <sighs> Natsuno-chan! Miwako! Aren't you supposed to be at training? Where are you off to in such a hurry? Where isn't really the... <sighs> Sorry, Miwako! What was that about? Hmm? Uh, Usami-chan? What happened to your leg? Did you hurt yourself? <sighs> she ignored me? That's not like Usami-chan. Oh, I've never even seen that place! Seriously, Miwako? Oh, but... I... What's going on? Yui-chan! So, I was saying... But that can't be right. No, it's true! I really did see them! That's the day we were waiting for you outside. And Usami-chan was with me the whole time. At the front gate, remember? Uh, that's right! So two Tomi Kisaragis. What the hell's going on? But what about Nachan? I, I mean, how did Natsuno Minami look? Hmm. She was in a hurry. She had her bag. Oh yeah. On my way back from delivering the copies. I saw another girl, but she was covered in dust. It was really weird. And now that I think about it, she was coming from where the bathroom was. Who was it? Hmm. Well, 
she looked mild-mannered. And I know I've seen her face around here before. But I don't know which year or class. So two Tomi Kisaragis. And... A girl covered in dust. What in the hell happened? In the girl's bathroom. <laughs> well, well.
all the people vanished from the city. It looks like the battlefield is totally empty. You really evacuated 1.2 million people. You did all that, Chihiro? That's crazy, Chihiro-chan. What did she even do? The D-forces are coming. But it's like she said. Now we can fight without worrying about collateral damage. Yikes. There's a ton of those bug guys coming this way. They're bigger than tanks, but still too small for sentinels. They'll be pretty hard for us to hit. Workers. About eight meters in size. They're general-purpose drones that can handle any terrain. They can also link up with the quadruped units. They form a kind of crane arm.
one next. They ought to be used to fights by now. Okay, they're like any other punks.
What's the plan? I guess life comes at you fast. This could get out of here. Within enemy threat range. Termination of enemy signals confirmed. Oh, God. 